guys so for some reason at the end of my video there when I came back my computer was really you know it was going really slow like my mouth totally didn't match up with the video I hope it works good now cuz I really, I really have nothing better to do than make videos at the moment you know I'm babysitting my brother he's 12 so you know I don't really have to watch him he's out there playing DJ hero his new game cuz his birthday's coming up soon so that's what he just got himself so I'm going to start with series, I'm just going to do series 16, I have 15 too, um, and some others, so I'm just going to do 16 because it's the one I have closest to me. So my first doll is Squeak, that's her box, um, I'm just going to take them out of the box afterwards, I've already taken her out a million times, but yeah, so she comes with this little pumpkin basket which hooks up into her hand. And she also comes with a little mitten. Well, she's got mittens on her hands. But I just took it off because it's easier for her to hold her basket. So this is like a trick-or-treat series. And they're so cute. I love her. She's one of my favorites from these series. And she comes with classic Living Dead doll shoes. They're actually more like boy shoes than the girl shoes. And this pink little one-piece pig outfit. And it's got like black dirt stains on it. And these little buttons. And she's got this cute little curly pigtail. So cute. And her hair is in pigtails. This one's kind of funky. And yeah, her face, it's gonna be hard to tell on the camera, I think, but her face has all these little purple veins all over it. Yeah, you totally can't see it very well, can you? So she's got all these little purple veins and her eyes are like bloodshot plus they're purple and they got all this like pinky color around them. And her nose and her mouth has this little like purpley pink color around it. So I don't know if I mentioned this, her name's Squeak. I think she's adorable. She's this cute little piggy girl. Her gloves come off. I'm not going to take this one off, though, because it's just a pain in the butt to get back on. So, yeah, this is her. I already showed you her box. She comes with this little pig mask, which is like a plastic. And it's also dirty. It's hard to tell on my camera, but it's, like, dirty. And I can put it on for you. It'll just take me one second. Oh, yeah, I forgot to mention. Her hair is, like, it's not a bleach. It's, like, a bleach blonde, I guess. It's not platinum. She's got these little bangs. She's just like a cute little girl. She kind of reminds me of um, Lulu. I don't have Lulu, but I've always wanted to have her. She's kind of got like the same hairstyle and stuff. So, all right, there's her mask. That's what she looks like. I like to display her without her mask because I think her face is much cuter. But yeah, that's what she looks like. Um, this series actually has minis of them. I haven't gotten the minis, um, I already have minis of, I can show you guys them afterwards, um, but my minis aren't really, I don't have any of the big dolls of them, let's just say that. So here's her chipboard foam, and it's kind of cool, it's got like a different design, it's like she's trick or treating at a door, and hers says, squeaks a little piggy that sure likes her treats. So roam she will the Halloween streets. So basically how she died, which I'll tell you before I read the death certificate, is I guess she ate some bad candy and she got poisoned and died. And all series 16 has orange paper, sort of to represent Halloween. And I will read you her death certificate in just a second once I get it out of the little bag. All right, so this is what it looks like. And it says, I hereby certify that on the 31st day of October, 1968, Squeak has been pronounced legally deceased. Poisoned by candy, Squeak met her demise, loaded with sugar, now covered in flies. So another lesson with the Living Dead dolls, um, 
for all you kids out there, make sure you get your parents to check your candy before you eat it because there are some weirdos out there that do poison their candy or put, you know, staples in it. Like, I've heard so many stories about that. Um, it's really dangerous, you know, and Squeak, you know, died because of it. So, hopefully that all you kids can be smart on Halloween and you won't end up like this poor little thing. Because that wouldn't be good, would it? Because I actually realized that a lot of the living dead dolls sort of have a moral lesson you can take from it, I guess. Um, for reasons that the dolls died, you kind of can relate to and tell other people, you know, that this is what can happen when you do certain things. So yeah, this is Squeak, series 16, and I will continue on with the other dolls from the series. Thanks, guys!